In recognition of Black History Month, we are honoring game changers, individuals who are making a positive impact on communities of color in our region. Cherry Gregg from KYW News Radio traveled to Northeast Philadelphia, where a team of sisters is beating the odds while helping others. I love purple. Uh, my favorite thing to do is to shop. This is Anisha Sakina. I like shopping. <laughs> And I read a lot. And Karima Trice. I'm a nurturer. They are sisters and share quite a bit, like clothes and feistiness. She's a more like bossy one. But they also share a diagnosis. Had you ever heard of an entire family of sisters being diagnosed with the same disorder? No. Anisha has lupus nephritis, which causes kidney failure. Basically needles, um, one down, one up. She needs dialysis three times a week. Sakina has systemic lupus erythematosis, or SLE. And that's the type of lupus that affects your joints, a lot of joint inflammation, um, skin. Um, I had a, a lot of seizures. And while Karima <laughs> hasn't been diagnosed, she has all the symptoms. My feet get swollen very bad to the point where I can't walk. But the sisters have not let lupus stop them. Along with mom Veronica, they founded Ask Lupus to educate black women who are three times more likely to develop the autoimmune disorder and are often misdiagnosed. I want us to be able to provide support to people all over the world. Part of the effort is leading by example. Sakina works as a lawyer, Anisha, a drug counselor, and Karima is a college student in spite of their health challenges. How do you feel like you ladies are changing the game? We're just making lupus something that's talked about and something that people don't have to be ashamed about. And showing through doing that life can be good, even with a disease like lupus. Cherry Gregg, KYW News Radio for CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Ah, uh, the sisterhood Great. is strong mm -hmm. and definitely changing the game.